This video clip is taken from the usability study of translation assistant. In order to avoid any voice communication, we located a Korean patient and English speaker in separate rooms. The screen on the left is translation assistant and the right is MSN webcam conference. As English speaker talks, likely topics will appear on the top white screen and the spoken keywords will be appear on the keyword list on the application. Korean patient reads through the topics, and the patient generates response phrase by selecting words from the keyword list. When Korean patient click one of the phrases from the phrase list, English speaker will hear the response through the computer-generated voice in English. Coupled with translation assistant, facial and bodily expression help Korean patient to understand what English speaker is talking about. As you can see on the webcam, English speaker makes gesture to communicate with Korean patient. The translation assistant is not trying to provide perfect English translation, but it tries to guess the context of what the speaker is talking about. With the help from the visual cues and the interaction with the translation assistant, Korean patient is able to communicate with the English speaker. The following clip shows the voice communication between English speaker and Korean patient through translation assistant in English. Hello, how may I help you? This is an emergency. I want to see a doctor. Do you have any identification? I have a passport now. Here is my passport. Okay, I will look you up in the system. You have never been here before. I have not been here before. Four seven. I will make you an appointment. Please have a seat in the waiting room and the doctor will call you. Where is the elevator? The elevator is around the corner. Where is the waiting room? The waiting room is upstairs. Can you please write that down for me? 